<laughs> gang, gang. Buzz, buzz. Back off my broccolini. Get your life together. It is. Don't touch me, bro. I'm not touching you, dude. You know, you know what I meant to ask, dude, is in, in, in Europe, how things go, dude? Huh? How'd it go in Europe? <laughs> I was getting some weird DMs. Were you? I was getting weird DMs, dude. From like, everyone's like, dude, I can't believe you do a podcast with Alanis Morissette, dude. This is crazy. <laughs> oh, they, said whatever, her, they, said her, they said her. They said, good luck following her, man. We don't know about her singing, but her set was fantastic. <laughs> I was like, what? That's Theo. Come on, England. Get Not on board. On you, man. I can't, uh. <laughs> dude, I'll tell you this, Does bro. she sing? Uh, <laughs> does she sing? That one song, well, how's it go? The pill. I just make a like one oh no! Day. Isn't it ironic? Yeah. Don't you think? It's, it's like, like rain. No, that's Jewel. <laughs> no, that's not Jewel with that the is titties. Jewel. No, Jewel's the one with the tits. Alanis Morissette's the one that looks like you. Yeah, everyone in Europe thought you were Alanis Morissette. Really? Man. They're like, she's funny as fuck, dude. Good luck falling that. I'm like, dude, that's Theo Vaughn. Yeah. And then how'd your cheeks do out there? A lot of people are like, damn, Theo got that fucking junk in the trunk. I'm like, I've been telling you guys for a hot second. He hides those cheeks. Bro, tell him for a fucking full warm minute, bro. I got that J in the tray. You got son. that roast beef <laughs> okay. in the back, bro. Uh -huh. Get them two honey baked hams. I got that freaking London B Royal, son. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Put a little crumpet on them cheeks. <laughs> Did you... The, what are you, they, are you just they, saying words? They don't like juicy asses in Europe, dude. Huh? They don't like juicy asses out there. I'm surprised you didn't get some work you done. You haven't even been there. Dude, I've been there several times. Really? My mom's from there. Dude, I'm yeah, surprised. Everybody's mom is from there. Dude, it's Europe. Well, yours. Well, you dude, yours every, from Europe? Everybody's family's from Europe, dude. Well, maybe originally. You no, know, everyone's really everyone's from the Middle East if you want to go way, way back. Not really, dude. Mm -hmm. You will not catch me being from the dang Middle hey, East. All I wanted to ask <laughs> is did you. Because you're a juicy ass in Europe, yeah. And because it's frowned upon there, did you even think about getting some surgery in Amsterdam? Because it's cheap. No, -uh. is it really? Yeah, get what that do they juicy do? ass taken down. They suck it right out, dude. Uh uh. Yeah, I dude, don't want one. that. What do they do? Do you get to take it with you? Do you no, they can put it in other parts. Oh, I get a little bit of that. Get a little bit of ass in my dick. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Do you have fun though, bro? Huh? I didn't hear from you much. Yeah, dude, I didn't hear from myself much, bro. Basically, it's winter over there, so it's not winter; it's like nighttime. So it's just like being in, in the nighttime for like two weeks almost. That's tough. So, but yeah, it was good, man. It was. Um, I heard they went crazy for you, man. Oh, we had a blast. Once they bro. figured out it was actually you and not Alanis Morissette, they were crunk. They just make it like one lay. Is that a no? Her isn't her song is it's like, it's like Oh, there she is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jay Leno, she's the one that almost blew Jay Leno in that movie theater. Alanis Morissette? Yeah. No, Jay yeah, Leno. Is. I think so, huh? Uh, no, that's Pee Wee Herman, dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. That is, uh... Dude, Jay Leno ain't getting down no movie <laughs> the theater, bro. Like, I'm listening to any of your ideas, dude. Sorry. <laughs> dude, you came back from Europe, and you think Jay Leno's getting blown by Alanis Morissette in movie theater? Dude, they call it my your brain they out call there, it, dude? They, bro, you look like a fucking Cinnabon that repeated third grade, bro. Okay? <laughs> dude. You look horrible, dude. Oh, my God, dude. Hey, where'd you get what your haircut out? Hey, where'd you get your haircut out there? Molested Sam's? <laughs> <laughs> that actually does sound like a sadly <laughs> decent place to get a car. <laughs> I'm gonna a, rub the molested Sam's real quick. Yeah, it's that time. It took a little off the top and it took a little off the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> they always focus more on the bottom, you know. Yeah, yeah that's my joke, Brendan. Okay. <laughs> No, I, was, I was punching it up for you, dude. Yeah, dude. You're a little rusty from Europe. Bro, the last thing you punched up gave you CTE. <laughs> so back off, dude. <laughs> Brother, waiting for you, though. A lot of people were asking about you. They were asking about Bobby Lee. Good luck in Bobby Lee over there. Yeah. I'm over there in April and May, but yeah, good luck in Bobby over there. I said Bobby. I Bobby travels over three hours <laughs> to do <laughs> shows. Yeah. He's like John Madden of comedy. You <laughs> will only take buses everywhere. Yeah, he is. He's like one of those like unique animals they have to put to sleep to move it. <laughs> yeah, unless a, if, if, if you can slingshot him over there like a sloth. It ain't happening, dude. You can forget about Australia too, man. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good point, dude. Bobby's definitely more that sleeping guy. Do you have fun over there, though, man? How was the food? The you don't seem too excited, dude. I thought you'd come back. Bro, it was just, it was a lot of like, there was no, it wasn't a vacation. You're you not know? hanging out. I wasn't like, I wasn't, I wasn't like in a gondola on the freaking <laughs> Rhine River. I wasn't like, 
you know, there was no, I wasn't at Buckingham Palace. Like, you didn't see the family jewels? <clears throat> no, I didn't see the family jewels, dude. I mean, I masturbated twice, you know, but <laughs> I didn't do anything extracurricular. You know, Ari Manis was with me. He went to, he was doing all the sex tourism, you know? Yeah. So we should have had him in here today. He's excited about that. The dark, <laughs> the dark web. Man. Yeah, he was on the dark Did web. Did he get on the European dark web? Dude, that's different. I don't know. Level, <laughs> yeah. Dude. European dark web? Yeah. It's basically have you like ever a, seen Hostel? Yeah, it's like in a medieval It's a documentary, times. bro. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> is it really? I think so. I think terrifying. I saw the second one. <laughs> Oof. It is crispy out there, man. Stay away from that darky web. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's on the dark web. So that... So yeah, what else? I'm trying, man. I feel it's like so we haven't crazy. been in it. Don't you forget? Cause you, you're doing so much shit. You feel, like if you ask me, we've been doing. Dude, we haven't seen each other in what, I don't know five weeks. I know. What have you been doing, man? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> Christmas. I, I fired my business manager because I found out you can't count. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thankfully you. Uh, <laughs> Nick loves Thankfully that you had the rest of us hire him too a couple months before. So <laughs> hey, we all learned the hard way. You know what I'm saying? Apparently he was investing in Ponzi. Nobody schemes. in here has gotten hey, paid. Apparently he was investing in Ponzi schemes and Reebok. <laughs> <laughs> New Reebok's coming up. Now BK Knights could be a hit. I put yeah, my money. You on right. Them. You right uh yeah man it was good bro i mean it was just dude it was just like it just yeah just, it was just crazy to see everybody from just different places you know gong gong bulls bulls you yeah. know just people with different accents you Doesn't know make you feel good like Nordic, all the way out there vikings man. people that men that had their hair braided in big long double braids oh, like that man there, huh? vikings yeah man real vikings. real vikings Dude, I mean, a guy shook his arm and a bunch of fucking snow fell off of it. Dang. Real Vikings, dude. Did they all carry axes? Uh, not in the not in the venue. They could have had them parked outside. That makes sense. Is that the same place where they go, you lay, and that, the girls are just blonde with fucking goo-goo. That's Hamburg, Germany, bro. <laughs> Did you go there, too? No, 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 no I didn't. I wish I would have gone to her Hamburg. I wish I would have gone to Copenhagen. Don't you wish you took more time? Yeah, that's see the I went out there I think three years. Chin, when did we got there three years ago. Nobody remembered. They said yeah. you hadn't come. About three years. Yeah, yeah all sold out shows. Chin me, went too. Me, just wow. me and Chin. No opener. Chin would get on the mic and go, ladies and gentlemen. I tell him to stop doing this. He go, ladies and gentlemen, uh, you're the man you came to see. He's my boss, uh, Brendan Shaw. <laughs> yeah, the crowd was like this. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> but the, Dude, here, here's the problem. I I, I want to say. I mean, you've been torn way long than me, so I don't want to give you an advice. Oh yeah, but I wouldn't for, take any. Yeah, <laughs> makes sense. You seem like you're doing well. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You, hey, you seem happy, so yeah. don't take any advice. Well, but, look, but the thing happy, we rushed, no, but doing well. Yeah, <laughs> we we rushed things, so I didn't see anything. But how? I, I might as well for? been in Iraq. Right. Like, yeah, we rushed. Every, I didn't see anything, dude. It was just show, 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 show. Yeah. They're on a plane. Like the fuck, dude. I didn't see anything. I saw the inside of theaters and green rooms. Yeah. And then shook people's hands. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, but but how long were you guys there when you went? Not long. It felt like a month. Yeah. It, it might have been like three weeks. Could have been a chunk. We weren't there month. three weeks. For all, the whole tour or just where? I don't know. Who, three who weeks, dude. That Chinese month. You feel me? <laughs> How's that CTE, Chin? Jesus Christ, Sorry. dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. Chin TE, they call it. But chin tea, yeah, yeah. That chin tea. <laughs> dude no i was there for 17 days but yeah it was like um yeah it was just theater to the place to like you know sometimes you get up and go walk around the town for a little bit yeah and then that was it there just wasn't uh, i mean i've been to europe before to see some stuff but it wasn't like a vacation that makes sense doing work dude well but well, a lot of well, great people came you, out man i missed you man oh thanks yeah. man i um, sent you a nice text you didn't respond back it's whatever is that true dude. i think so. it might not have come overseas yeah. man <laughs> cricket do, cricket doesn't work over in europe they prevent a lot of uh you know there's a lot of like sex trafficking and stuff that's that dark way. you know i should have texted sorry because he gets texted. oh he gets it all dude he's yeah. got his vpn open he's got his browser he's got a helmet that's picking up fucking he has that blackberry <laughs> oh dude he's got the See, that suit. blackberry He's got the super blackberry, dude. Yeah. One the of blackest like, berry. Yeah. What, at one point, it was just Chappelle Lacey to say it numbers for him. So, with an iPad. Yeah, it's Chappelle yeah, Lacey yeah. with an iPad. That's his blackberry. So, yeah, like, hey, man, this won't shut up singing Green Day all the fucking time. <laughs> well, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Damn, you're dude. my wonder wall. <laughs> hey, man. This fucking... 
Dude, Chappelle, man, he's like Rodney King of the Hill, dude. <laughs> he has such a country accent wanted, for a black guy. <laughs> it's so strange, but he grew up in Arizona. And he fucking he has sure Blink he 182 flowing to his veins. Oh, he has a country twang. Oh. It's so confusing. He has this is my last resort tattooed on his back. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then he keeps talking about he has good Matt talk. Because <laughs> a cheerleader, but dude, bro. They were excited. They're like, send Bobby Lee, man. Send Bobby. Tell him we want him. We'll try, man. We're coming, we're coming to see Brendan next month, man. We're coming to see Brendan next month. So, yeah, people were excited, bro. It was just wild to see, like, just different people be excited. They had, uh, yeah, British people. Dude, I was laughing so hard at your story. Me and Callan were in the studio. We were laughing so hard. He posted Ari bombed. Oh, he fucking. Because some, oh, some material won't work. Up. Some material doesn't translate. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was so funny. It was so funny. Bro, he bombed. He came back, dude. He was fucking sweat. You can see it on his face. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's the best part. His face is all, dude. I don't know, man. Like, yeah. <laughs> you're like, I was listening here. I had to turn it off. Yeah. yeah. I said, at least you get to bomb and go to a nice hotel. Dude, when I was coming up, you had to bomb and fucking just go sleep under your own hands. Like, like, it was a In different the green time. Room. <laughs> yeah. Different time. <laughs> different time, bro. Oh, man, dude. Dude, yeah, it was great. I mean, just hearing, you got to hear, there were people, like, just, like, homeless people, different countries, you know? They'd be like, I'm homeless. He's like, yeah, sure you are, bro. Yeah, whatever, dude. <laughs> not with that cute accent, you're not. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> not with that cutie little accent, bro. You ain't nobody, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let me buy you a couple of chocolates, bro. That's my big thing is giving chocolate to the homeless, bro. What kind of chocolate are you giving out? Milk chocolate. I don't go anything high. You don't end go dark. Homeless. You don't do the like the eighty percent cocoa. I feel like they've been they through need, enough. Bro. Yeah, but you don't want them thinking about drugs. Like, oh, I got eighty percent cocoa. You know, I got ten percent angel dust. Let me see what I can mix up. <laughs> see what, what happens. I'm, I'm about to fucking yeah. I'm about to get Nestle quick up in this motherfucker. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> so yeah, I think that's part of the issue, bro. Oh man. But we're back, dude. We are back. Street back. All right. The bros are back in town. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Dude, new studio's looking pretty tasty, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad, bro. Dude, this S studio. Looking Step this game up. Tasty, huh? Ooh. Fucking cut my hand on that. Oh, look at these bad mm. mammoths. Put the goddamn... Coke a little bit of it. seed on it, huh? I don't know what's on Could that. be a little bit of dried skeet, bro. It is. <laughs> it is uh, Nick and Chin have been in here, so. All night. Yeah, I was up all night. That's how I stayed up. Were you up all night? Yeah. Damn. Mm -hmm. Working on this? Yeah, yeah. The really? Because you had five weeks. <laughs> 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 I work on deadlines. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, well, we haven't been here about five weeks. <laughs> <laughs> That's well, to each its were, own, man. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, this, they were a real bee and a real rat whenever we started, so yeah. had to get them killed. You had to get them. <laughs> had to iron them out. A lot went on, brother. Drop a lot of honey. Dude, we're back. We're back, baby. 2020. God dang. We're getting old, dude. Yeah, we are, man. Oh. Just getting old. Well, thanks for having me, man. <laughs> wow, it's your world, man. I'm just living in it, dude. Well, I'm just happy to be here, man. Thank you for having me. Well, thanks. <laughs> Thanks for allowing me to have it here. Dude, hey, I'm not uh, allowing you. You're having me here. I'm happy okay. to be here. Okay, man. Well, it's good to see you. What I'm saying. Hey, dude. did you play quarterback for uh, Aaron Hernandez uh, in high school? Huh? <laughs> what? No. I don't know. Random question. Why? I know. That just popped in my head. I don't know. Did you guys see the Aaron thing? Oh, I saw mm -hmm. it. Did you see it? Oh, yeah, I didn't like the part at the end. They tried to make him seem like a gay man. I, don't, I feel like they kind of squeezed that they really in. They kept forcing the gay thing, man. And I didn't trust the young dude who said that he might have been gay. Oh, dude. They, oh, it came out. That guy's full of shit. Yep. Because the real dude came out. was like, that kid didn't even play quarterback. Yeah. That guy's full of shit. Yeah. Yeah. Him and the dad were full of shit. The dad was The dad, too? They, they, they were both ready to like, because they were like dropping like gems. Like they, everything was prepared and they had like one-liners. I'm like, mm -hmm. what the fuck is happening right now? Yeah. 
The dad did have one liners. Yeah, he did. They're great. The dad was that fucking straight cannoli hustler too. He had a big <laughs> mouth on him. You see yeah, that? Yeah, he did. Big Can mouth. We bring up a picture of the dad. Do you mind, real quick? He spoke well too, and the kid was lying his ass off. He's like, "Man, me and Aaron, you know, we get done with practice, we just go to his room. I'd suck him off." I'm like, "Dude, I'm not. That's not what. That's not the way people talk, dude." Did he say yeah, that? Yeah, man. I didn't hear that part. I listened to the whole thing. Really? I had the uncut version. Yeah, man, you must. Bro. There's the dad up a little more. If There's you don't that mind. piece of up shit up a little more, right there, there to the right, right there. Father of the guy <laughs> who experimented with Aaron Hernandez. <laughs> the Dude. internet's too much, man. The internet's, <laughs> much. internet's undefeated. Dude, this guy <laughs> looks like Joey Dontaz. <laughs> if you look at him, dude, he looks very strange. Dude, get you a girl who's as loyal as Aaron Hernandez girl. Yeah. <laughs> This guy looks like Joey Diaz of Pam right here. If you can look he, at he looks kid. like Joey Diaz and Sam Tripley had a baby. <laughs> <laughs> um, His girl was down, dude, though. I'd Hiding f- guns and shit. Yeah. Yeah, but come on. Not shocked about that. Really? Yeah. Uh, dude, he murdered her sister's boyfriend, <laughs> and she still sat next to him. You dude, know how gangster that is? If somebody marry, murders my sister's boyfriend, dude... You celebrate? I know. I'm gonna hide a gun for like, I, yeah. Somebody else already got murdered, dude. I'm gonna do whatever needs to be done to not get murdered. <laughs> yeah, but she, that's true. That's true. You could be next. That's a legit point. Yeah, I'm not gonna be like, no way, Buster. <laughs> that shit ain't gonna fly. to you. You're gonna get fucking well, murdered, you, bro. Or, or you could just go to the cops. Yeah. Like, yeah, oh, yeah. He asked me to hide the gun. <laughs> if you want to be a straight fucking snitch. That's true. She was fucking down, she though, was. man. She was super. Even, even at the, the very end. But she was the baby mama. She had to be. And dude. she didn't have much else going on, dude. I mean, at that point, yeah, she's already cashed out with the fucking body eggs. She's got the baby from the man. What is she going to do? Dude, his CT was so bad. That motherfucker, they told him he's getting life. And every time they talked to him, he's like, I can't wait to get out of here, man. I yeah. do a, few, a few days. She was like, the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, I'll be out in an hour. Yeah. yeah. Is that, I'm, I'm just waiting for my papers. Yeah, he's like, well, I make it to see WrestleMania. And they're like, <laughs> I'm like what? Like what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, he's like I didn't kill Nicole Brown Simpson. <laughs> hey man, tell, tell Brady, him. tell tell Brady I'll be there Sunday. Tell yeah. him not to worry, <laughs> dude. They're not even in season, bro. He's the only one running out routes in the shower, dude. <laughs> yeah, man, it's wild. It seemed like he was just I don't know, like he just didn't. Did you feel bad for him? It's a good question, man. I did. I felt really well, the bad docu- for him. Here's the thing about documentaries. It focuses so much sometimes on one person. It gives you so much of their story that I think as a human, you can't help but feel sorry for them because you're learning so much about them. But you, if they'd have focused more on the boy, you know, the Odin, Odin Lloyd, Lloyd, they got killed. Not the It might have made you feel. Man, yeah. It might have made you feel more for a him. You know? Yeah, it could be another documentary that's just about him, and you're like, oh shit. And makes, uh, yeah, it makes Aaron seem like a monster, but also like. That Odin Lloyd, they said he was murdered because he knew about Aaron being gay. Really? Yeah. He well, was, he was, wore that he, hat, dude. He, he was he, he was gonna he was gonna out him. Really? So Aaron was like, "Cool, I'm gonna kill you." <laughs> but who's he gonna out him to? Who even would have believed that? That is true. Just that high school quarterback <laughs> and his dad. And his dad, like I told y'all. <laughs> It's crazy, yeah. right? It's a, it's just a you know what it is? It's a tragic story. You're just like, damn, yeah, it's dude. Just tragic. You know, he was better than Gronk. He was dude. amazing player. He's not better than Gronk, dude. He's more talented he really than good. Gronk for sure. Mm. Nah, he wasn't. So <laughs> yeah, wow, it didn't even take me a long time to think about that one, dude. It took you dude, a little Brennan while. It seemed like the kind of guy who works at a concession stand, but he says it's closed so he can have all the snacks inside. Of it. <laughs> <laughs> Should have came earlier, <laughs> dude. It's seven a.m. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> fresh out. Yeah, it says closed, but you listen in there, and you just hear a bunch of fucking music going on, and somebody just having a, having a bunch of hot dogs, <laughs> smoking drunk. in the boys' room. Yeah. <laughs> I wish, man. Hey, we're out of mustard. You're like, what do you mean you're closed? <laughs> I thought you just said you're closed. Dude. <laughs> I know we sent Chin on this date. I can be more excited about it. I didn't. I didn't even ask. I didn't even ask. I didn't even look on social media. And I didn't want to know how it went. Nothing. No, I've been saving it just for this. Well, I, I saw one picture of Chin like feeding her, and I was like, well, 
Hopefully you're still alive. <laughs> well, that's a bite that I don't get. That's what you're thinking, I bet. <laughs> you're like, damn. There's 40 carbs for daddy that are going astray. I'm taking that out of Chin's paycheck, huh? <laughs> Oh, we're closed. <laughs> uh, Nick, what do we have? What do we do for Chin? Get us into this world. Uh, they went out on a. Isn't Derek going to lead us into it? He's got the video. All right, there we go. Ready to go, bro. So, so, you know what's up, dude? Oh, uh, so, this video I haven't seen either. Nick, Nick put the video together. So I'm seeing it for the first time. Do, too. do, do we need to ask Chin any question before we go on this, or should we watch this first? I think we watch this little sizzle reel, and then we'll get the recap from Chin, and then we can Facetime Carly later and see what she got. Oh, yeah, we got it ready to go. Hot Carl. <laughs> Dude, that's the worst name for a girl. It's not a good. <laughs> no, name she liked it. Yeah, uh, I don't know. If she did. <laughs> did you call her Hot Carlton at all during the date? I called her Tito. Oh, that's beautiful, man. Tito. Yeah, yeah. Tito. So obviously, Chin has a little bit of that Aaron Hernandez in him. You know, <laughs> if he's naming women men and still trying to hook up with them, <laughs> yeah, you ain't fooling nobody. Well, that's a gateway Let, drug yeah. to homosexuality. Yeah, yeah. let's call oh, Chin's Tito. quarterback in high school. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get into yeah, it. I'm on the was, line right now. Just kidding. This <laughs> was the first date. This was the first gender date, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, real quick. Kat, were you there? Yes, I was. Were you there, Dean? I, I was with you in San Jose. Okay, I see T. <laughs> Nick, were you there? <laughs> yep, and so was our uh, videographer, Mike Nell, who really hooked it up. We we th threw together uh, basically an episode of Blind Date with a three-man team. Okay, and, don't uh, brag, but let's see how it goes. It went let's pretty see well. how it goes. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> I've seen a lot of Blind Date, so... Hey, do you, do you mean blind date or to catch a predator? <laughs> <laughs> I don't trust Chin, dude. All right, let's do well, this. Well, I don't trust Chin either. I don't know what you guys are talking about right now, but I also do not trust Chin. <laughs> or Chinese, as they call them. Well, my plan for tonight was to do what a typical Korean night is, right? So oh, usually we'd go, we'd grab drinks, uh, get Korean barbecue, grab dessert, which is usually boba, if you're Asian, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And there's, there's boba a specific fat. boba that I love that I want her to try. And then afterwards, Swallow them go balls. to a karaoke studio and get even more drinks. Yeah. And then let me do what I think I do best. Yeah. Yeah, Jim. Yeah, Jim. Look at my boy. Sing, when sing. was the last time you were on a date? Um, I think you might know this, but it's been a while. It's been a while. Yeah, it's been a while. I'm going to be honest with you, Kat. I've never in my life ever been on a date with what we would call a Mi Chang. A white girl. That's the N word for white girl in China. Wow. <laughs> hey, also known as a cracker where I come from. How dare you, Jin? Wow. So, Carly, how are you feeling today? Good. Good. Are you excited? You! Yeah. <laughs> Watch the show, Brendan. Check out the bobas on Carly. It's a, someone of another race. Is that the same for you? No, I'm not. I don't really. No, it's more just like another date. Another date, <laughs> oh, but cute. a little different. Carly, bang it, Jim. Is there any? You fucked this up, bro. Concerns. You're a creep, bro. Put your my pants off. My friends have my location, dude, I, so I don't know. People I'm just put your spare, spare ribs, little ribs with her, bro. I know where I am. Dude, do not pull your pants on if you're gonna break out that little dick again. <laughs> <laughs> right. I don't know. This is gonna be fun. Ooh, what are we sipping on there, beer? Bad idea. You can be farting, Chin. I love ah. the dumplings. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hot coral. Oh, well, oh, well, there you go. Hot day. Hey. Oh, she's cute, huh? Look at she's, Chin. Look is that a nose piercing? Whoa, Chin. She has a nose piercing. <laughs> Drinking. <laughs> you know, having fun. Have a dude with you? No guy friend. <laughs> Hit the elbow here, and you'll hear like. Do that. Yeah. This is just tradition. Oh. It doesn't do shit, <laughs> but it's fun to do. Oh, it's about alcohol. Uh, what are you doing? There. There's a lot more room. Lot no. more. Oh my God! A lot more way? room in there. He said. All right, let's go. A lot more room. He said, let's tighten up, girl. Ooh, Jin's nice on the grill. Jin, did you do an Asian style? Make her cook that shit? Not on the first date. Oh, okay. Second date to the nine thousand date. <laughs> Second date to life. She's been cooking. Damn, she ain't running that beat, boy. Yeah, bro. That sizzler heater. Oh, Ooh, drip, drip, chin. Taking that. Which oh, juicy boy in there? That shit juicy. Grabbing that wet snack. Yeah, like baby. Dumb, boy. <laughs> oh, chin with that thrust, bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, chin. 
post date with Kat. Here we go. <laughs> okay, so how was the date? It was great. It was great. So, Ooh, what do so you much. think? Overall, She's drunk. She's drunk. Your experience dating or going on a date with an Asian guy was. Oh, it was way better than I thought it'd be. <laughs> oh, man. Way better than I thought. You know what? It looked better than I thought it would be, too, dude. That's why I've never dated an Asian man or any man for that matter. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad we saw that. And you uh, men leave so, me alone. That's what So I'm now, saying. do we do. Does it go to like. Chinder after dark? Is that it? We have a sizzle reel just for you guys to watch in studio because we thought to watch the whole thing it'd be a bit much. But we've got like a 12-minute thing that's going to drop the same time this episode does that yeah. you see a little bit more of their conversation. But yeah. but Korean barbecue was the entire date, so okay. that was it. And then we also have a little uh, exit interview yeah, with Chin here that might be the highlight. Yeah. Highlight. All right. I'm going to be honest. Okay. I didn't think I would like her that much. Because she's white. But she's Fuck actually you, pretty Chin. fucking cool. Yeah. And very funny. And sweet and nice, and we got along pretty well. Well, yeah. what was your favorite part of the date? Um, it's gonna sound really bad, but <laughs> she's, we sat next to each other, right? Mm -hmm. And every time we would take shots together, mm -hmm. her tits were like right here. <laughs> <laughs> and as soon as I would take a shot, I would see it, and they were just, well, I would look to see we, if they would jiggle. Well, we lost if they the jiggled, day. <laughs> if they would the jiggle. <laughs> We lost. Well, Chinky. No, you lost. We, we, we've been winning the entire game. And I you threw fuck you the only way. We can't fumble. hear him. We can't hear him, dude. I fumbled. I'm honest. Again. I'm honest. Because okay, today I was supposed to go karaoke with her, too. And then I think it was just so perfect that we should just leave this alone and then do a second date with karaoke. Mm. And then also, I hope she wears something low top because that was lost. probably my favorite part of the date. Lost the game. <laughs> Okay, that's perfect. Thank you. That's all well. <laughs> <laughs> that's perfect. Good job, Kat. Thanks. That's nice. Oh, man. That man, was that was How about that chinder, huh? That was great. Good that job, Kat. Stuff. Good job, Nick. Chin. Thank you. <sighs> you, you know, you, you're winning all, all, all three quarters. We got in the fourth. And yeah. you, you panicked, dude. I know. Honestly. So, why didn't, yeah, why didn't things escalate? Because it seemed like you guys had a nice time at the dinner. Y'all was doing the meat and everything. Somebody had you had two or three types of meat out there. She's yeah. on the wobbly pop. She's laughing. Wobbly, for sure. Yeah. So why not take it to karaoke? And we get that night vision out, Doug. Uh, or bariyoki, where you guys get bare bar naked, huh? I mean, if we went to karaoke, I know for, oh, first of all, ending it that way was probably perfect. Like, a, you know. Oh, yeah. You're, you're at a peak of like, it's awesome. So yeah. end it there. And then if I, we were karaoke. I know what I could do there. Yeah. And then stuff could happen after that. Yeah, those sweater puppies would I'm not going to have you guys film me <laughs> after karaoke. Yeah, dude. I mean, you could film well, that on your own. Thing. Yeah, you could you could do something. With yeah, it, we know? could do a drawing yeah. of it. I would do it for you. Nick? Dinner was two hours and 20 minutes, too. Like, they just can't. We, uh, Kat, Mike, and I all ate. Korean barbecue at the same time and we were done like an hour in and they just kept had food and drinks coming out like they had a blast and after the date Carly just kept saying I'm down for anything I'm down for anything oh. <laughs> but she wasn't down for chinny thing bro <laughs> yes yeah, yeah, she was yes yeah, she was dude and he fumbled he fumbled the ball he fumbled dude he's dressed like George Michael dude at a funeral of course he fumbled dude he looks like somebody that plays a keyboard in a, at a, at a on a late night television show. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> of course, he fumbled. <laughs> Bro, Chin is one step away from a deaf guy. Okay, <laughs> dude. What? Of course, he fumbled, dude. Dude, he didn't have any arms, dude. <laughs> he I'm was so carrying the ball in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> of course. He fumbled. I'm, I'm so disappointed. Why are you disappointed? It was great. Hot car was so down, dude. And your superpower is singing. You didn't even get there. But no, but I think you played a smart move. Be yes. good, be gone. That's the move. You be do enough. well, you do, and you get out. You were there, Kat. You were on the front lines. I was. Um, <laughs> front lines. What was the female perspective of this uh of this little Vietnam nom 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 because they ate for two hours. <laughs> hey, who paid for this thing? Huh? Did we pay? Hopefully, for it? we did. Did we? Uh, I'll give you the receipts later. Yeah. Okay. Oh wow. Yeah. It was good. Chin was killing it in the beginning, yeah. and then he lost energy. Right? No, it wasn't Brandon. that. It was She's gonna he tell got us. a little too much energy towards the end in the post interview, like you said. But to be fair, she also was very tipsy. Mm. She was down to have like. Not just a good night, but maybe like a good morning if 
they they what went a, to karaoke. What a good girl. <laughs> what a she good was girl. fun. What a positive attitude. She told oh. me on her Uber Did, Do we have ride, an exit interview with her? Uh, yeah, we had a part of it in that clip, actually. That'll be in the longer thing on YouTube. You can check it out, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we can talk we, to her. We can go straight to we her. We can FaceTime her. We can. She's not, well, at, well, work. We, she's not at work. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, she's, she's still re recovering from the GHB... <laughs> Meat that Chin was serving over there, dude. Okay, <laughs> she come from that fucking, fucking yeah. beef teriyaki dipped in night quill. Chin had yeah. going on over there. That freaking beef scary hockey, <laughs> dude. So where, where have I? This tastes familiar. That fucking, Is this night quill? That beef very sleepy. Chin was serving her, dude. Damn boy, that melatonin chicken, huh, Chin? I know. <laughs> Chin over there serving those uh, them, them Bill Cosby fucking skewers, baby. Yeah. <laughs> them B Cosby fritters over there. Chin's over there <laughs> grilling up, huh? B Cosby falafels, baby. Yeah. On a pillow of rice, dude. A huge pillow of rice. Yeah. Basically on a bed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what are we going to talk to her about first? Let's just don't call her blindly, dude. Let's just, God, you suck with women. Yeah, you have to. Remember, <laughs> yeah, last, time, remember last time you're like, uh, do you like TV? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I want to be prepared, okay? <laughs> we just saw what happens when you don't prepare and go out with somebody. Okay? Well, I don't know he's going to talk about her tits. <laughs> God damn it, Chin. I thought it was going to be real cute. Chin was like, yeah, all, all I was thinking the whole time is yeah. as soon as she would, as she would cheers me, her fucking... We Tits would <laughs> squeeze together <laughs> in my mouth, man. What? Everyone's all, what the fuck is happening right here? The real chin came out. Chin uh, shady. Um, yeah, so what are we going to talk to her about? Chopsticks? Yeah, we're going to say, how was the evening? <laughs> okay, well, here's the thing. Chin. Would you go on a second date? That's what we need did to Did you out. have fun? Where did he mess up? <laughs> did, did you go... Did you go on a date after that? Did you have a friend pick you up from there? Did you go do some other karaoke? Ooh, wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she might have. Maybe she had a late She's night like, man. He, or she was like, I was down for more. And then Chin just took off talking about, you know, some bullshit. They had to go do sing in his bedroom. <laughs> so I had my friend pick me up. Yeah, we sent her in an Uber home. And it was going to the address she gave she was originally picked up at. But she asked to take a detour. And she ended up going to Newport Beach. She partied more that night. Who did knows? Did she really? Yeah, yeah, what, she did. What a good girl. Wow, let's see how this what ended up there. savage. Because Chin might have said her. Chin might have just really. Yeah, no, he yeah. just, he just, he just, just put her, her and shit. This guy. Chin's the Jason kid to get nasty. He might have had an assist, bro. Let's see what we got right here. Lob man. City. You feel me? It's Lob City over there. Bro, I'll tell you what I'm on right now, man. Dude, can I tell you my problem before no. you tell me yours? Can oh. I tell you my problem? Okay. I can't get enough greens, man. I been can't? I take spinach. I, 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 and I take broccoli. And it's just, it's so much work. It sounds like it, man. It's not how you do it, man. You it's, gotta boil it or cook it down. Uh, just, I don't know, man. Dude, or you, you know what you need, man? Athletic greens, bro. What are you talking about? You think I'm talking about aliens that do track and field? Yeah. No, dude. I'm talking about athletic <laughs> greens. It's the ultimate daily all-in-one health drink. It has 75 vitamins, minerals, and whole-sourced ingredients that make it easier for you to get comprehensive nutrition without the need for pills, powders, and complex routines, man. Wow. It's the most complete supplement for a better you. Wow, no capsules? Bro, I take it every morning. You mix it in, you throw a little deal, it comes in this nice little dealy deal. One scoop of Athletic Greens provides a convenient, affordable, and tasty solution to fill the gaps in your diet. Oh. Dude, I'm going to die right now. You know me, I struggle with my weight, dude. I'm thick. Oh, I stay thick, dude. Definitely, dude, definitely. bro. Definitely. I'll drink gravy if you leave it out. Dude, if I... But now that I'm on Athletic Greens... Every time I walk by you, I hear an oven... T uh, I ding. hear an oven, yes. Ding. Go off. I got like, you. Damn. Ding. The biscuits are done, huh? Them cinnamon <laughs> buns. <laughs> Toasty, bro. Not anymore, bro. Joke's on you because I take athletic greens, all right? Yeah. Oh, really? I start every day with athletic greens. I've, Dude, been so fooling, I've been fooling you the whole time. Why do you think my energy's through the roof? Why do you think, my, why do you think I'm never sick? My gut health is fantastic. Oh, yeah. That's probably why because of athletic greens. No joke. Athletic greens, I take it every day. I'm getting my mother some as a gift. It's gluten-free. It's dairy-free. It's vegan-friendly. No harmful chemicals. No pesticides. So if you got worms or something like that, bro, you still can keep them, bro. It's not going to kill them. Man, give them a deal. How about that? How about that? You want to be healthy? You want a healthier lifestyle? Maybe an athlete? Yeah, Try look, to find a little edge? Hit them. Uh, 
I got the deal for you. Give them that. Green Athleticgreens.com slash K A T S. Get the cats, get the cats, get the cats. And claim my special offer today 20 free travel packs valued at $79 with your first purchase. That's athleticgreens.com slash K A T S. Get the cats, get the cats, get the Greenies. cats. Look, we hate to interrupt it, but whew, something has to be done, man. I'm sick of this bush, dude. I have a giant bush, like a 70. Oh, I thought you were talking about the 94 election. Oh, no, no. You're talking about George Bush? <laughs> no. I'm not about this bush. Oh, damn, yeah. Oh, dude, yeah, bro. Yeah. You got that. It freak. looks like George Bush's neck <laughs> oh, dude. with an afro. <laughs> Here's the thing. You got that George Clinton growing around your junk, dude. You're not anymore, bro, because there's a new trimmer just released moments ago. Yeah, I'm talking about the Lawnmower 3.0 Manscaping Trimmer. Mm -hmm. It's available for purchase right now. Yep, this third generation Manscaped Trimmer features a cutting edge ceramic blade to prevent manscaping accidents. So many people out there, dude. A lot of times, if you put your ear out of a car window, you could hear somebody nick their nuts over 70 miles away. Yeah, I'm talking about a real proper premium nut cutter. Mm -hmm. uh, a mean premium. The battery will last up to 90 minutes. Well, it doesn't take that long, but you never know, dude. But how beautiful is it to be cut trimming around your freaking junk for 90 minutes, That's, the, that's the Lord's work. Dude, you're like Pablo Picasso at that hey, point, dude. Bro. You tightening up that freaking body blade. Son. Yeah, tighten it up and get 20% off and free shipping with the code KATS at manscaped.com. And as always, your balls will thank you. Yep. Get 20% off and free shipping with the code KATS at manscaped.com. That's 20% off with free shipping, manscaped.com. Use code CATS. And one of the coolest new features that they have is the LED light. So you can groom your crotch in the, in the dark. Do it in the dark. Do saying, it in the dark. Dude. Do it like the bats do it. Get risky, dude. Like Bear grills, bro. Yeah, dog. Do it like the owls. Yeah. There you go. Make sure I look nice in the damn girl. You, ain't out, you, ain't, you ain't at work, girl. Maybe she is at work. She got to have a meeting at eleven fifty. She well, that's. Ooh, what's up, girl? Hey. How you doing? <laughs> You're so cool. Is she? Are you hungover right now? <laughs> no. Uh, oh, she looks nice, man. She's not hungover. No, I think she looks nice. She could also be hungover as well. She can't be drinking at work. We just saw the date. Did, thank. That, first of all, thank you for going with Chin. Yeah, you're a good sport. Oh, yeah. No, honestly, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, it seemed like you guys had a lot of... Chemistry. Yes, and liquor. <laughs> <laughs> and beef. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. How, uh, what, what did you enjoy about the evening? Uh, everything. Honestly, it was really... It was an easy date, hangout thing. Uh, it wasn't, I don't know, it's not, it wasn't weird. I thought it might be because mm -hmm. I didn't maybe. talk to it. Yeah. Well, so, I mean, like I said, I didn't really know too much about your guys' like podcast and who you guys are until my friend sent me in. And so I was reading people's comments on like YouTube and Instagram and stuff. And so I was like, why is everyone calling this guy like a murderer? <laughs> <laughs> don't read YouTube comments, girl. That's not going to help you. <laughs> Take it with a grain of salt because I mean, I have a ton of friends that are guys, so I can get guy talk. But then, so I was like, okay, whatever. And then when he texted me like two days before, I was like, oh, this guy seems really normal. So I was like nervous going into it. And I'm a pretty social person, so I wasn't really afraid. Uh, so just, it was kind of just normal. <laughs> Yeah, it seemed like you guys had a really nice time. It seemed like everybody had a really nice time. It went way better than we thought. I got to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> we thought you were going to show up with bodyguards. <laughs> well, I thought about, I did talk to a couple of my friends like, okay, when it happens, like we'll stake out at the bar. That's smart. And stuff. And then they ended up not coming. So I Is that your first on. time? Is that your first time getting uh, Korean barbecue? It was my second. Yeah. I knew it. So but it for but. I knew like, it. Yeah, I kind of what it. you think it would be. I don't know. Yeah, I hear you. Crazy. I'm not that big of a fan, but. And now we also had a question for you. Brendan. Oh, uh, <laughs> so it seemed like you're having a great time afterwards, and and maybe you guys were gonna do karaoke. Then Chin was like, "Oh, I gotta go," and took off. And then did you? What did you do after dinner? Uh, I went and met up with some friends. Hell yeah. Like they were like one of my best friends. This girl was in. Sounds like a guy. Them. So we went and <laughs> yeah, I met up with them. 
I was like, oh, okay, well, they're out. I'll go hang out with them. Why not? <laughs> and did the they ask young. you about the date? What did you tell them? What was your first response to them? Uh, they, well, I was like texting them and I was like, no, it was really fun. It was normal. Uh, I did tell them, I was like, oh, it was funny. We did like pre and post interviews and stuff. And they were just dying at it. They thought it was the funniest thing. Oh, had, like, had you ever, and this was the first time you'd ever been out with a Mongol, right? <laughs> It's a legit question, right? It's a legit question. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Them Genghis Khan vibes, you feel me? <laughs> no, I look. I think it's brave. You know, some people are brave or afraid to date out. You know, just date somebody that's any different than them, especially somebody that's from f not only from Asia but from outer space. <laughs> 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 Like our unique man Chin here, but no, it seemed like you guys had a great time. Um, yeah, he he was he was curious. I mean, I'll let him ask you, but this is just me kind of, I guess, asking for him. Would you be down to do a second date, some karaoke? Because that's where he really shines. <laughs> I know. Well, I was honestly kind of thankful slightly that we didn't do karaoke, only because, like, you. I, I mean, I didn't do like a ton of research, but I know like he can sing and stuff. And then before, and Kat was like, oh yeah, no, he's like really good. And I was like, okay, shit. Like, this is going to be really bad. Yeah. Well, what's something that you're oh, good no. at? Like an extracurricular thing or uh, capability? Oh no, like I'm totally fine with karaoke. I'm just really bad at it. That's so fine. you could use somebody to teach you probably a little something. Show you the rope. He'll, he'll bring you his guitar. <laughs> ropes. Sorry. <laughs> Just one rope, not two. Yeah, just one. Uh, the ropes. No, the rope. Karaoke would be fine. I think I would be down to go and go at karaoke and hang out. I mean, romantically speaking, I'm not sure, but he was really fun and well, uh, and my good company. <laughs> hate to uh, romantic. You just not your type. Is it? What, what is it? Because he's a big, handsome dude, tall dude. Chicks mm -hmm. dig him. I yeah, he's Dude's really tall. <laughs> I'm really short. Are you really short? You look tall in I, the video I, I saw recently. <laughs> just now. You look tall. You look tall enough. Sorry. How tall are you? You keep talking. Five three. <laughs> five three standard. Oh I'm yeah, five three short. is a good height. Yeah. Anything yeah. could happen. Yeah, five three I can't standard. Reach the top of the cabinet. Yeah, you can yeah, shop but anywhere though. Yeah. You, know? you can still do stuff. Nobody looks weird if you're outdoors or anything. You don't look like, oh, yeah. you shouldn't be out here. You're not tiny. <laughs> That's four eleven and under. People are like, What's going on? Where's your folks all the time? <laughs> you know, and you're like, I'm forty. What do you mean? But what 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 points <laughs> what points would you give Chen if we continue to do uh dates with him? What do you where where does he go wrong? Now is it and now is it a thing where just because he's Asian, maybe that's not your flavor, which is fine. <laughs> like I don't like shrimp <laughs> Favorite in top ramen, you know? <laughs> no, I'm not like that. I mean, I'm 25, so 42 is a little. You're 42, Chin? Yeah. Jesus Christ. You guys know that you're that either. Dude, oh dude no, hey, that where's so Chris Harrison? <laughs> you want to have a seat? I'm so sorry, Carly. <laughs> yeah, I want to wow. apologize too. I had no idea. I, I that forgot. We were Sending you out with one of your dad's friends. <laughs> I didn't know we were sitting out with your dad's co-workers <laughs> yeah. to fucking barbecue. Of course you're not going to like karaoke with them. <laughs> uh, but no. But God, I, what's next? A date with fucking Jerry Garcia? Yeah. We apologize. <laughs> Actually, we got a Ouija board here and Winston <laughs> Churchill wants to go on a date with you. <laughs> <laughs> no, we think that it's great that you went. I thought you were a great sport. You were perfect and, uh, for the first one. For the, yeah. You're fantastic. But, but you know, we'll find someone around his age that he'll like. <laughs> um, what, do you, what could he do better, though? What, what do you think you could improve on? What? What's, he, what's he missing, nothing. you think? Nothing. See, that's Chin's problem. Uh, Chin says nothing, and that can't be the case, you see, know? I don't really think any. I mean, honestly, I'm my biggest thing when I go on dates with people is, like, I can have a conversation with a wall, literally. Love it. Um, like, I'm really social. Yeah. So if someone can't hold a conversation with me, then that's just, like, a problem. Yep. But he obviously like, held a conversation. He's super funny. Yeah, he's fun. Um, he's nice. Yeah. He, he's normal. Yep. <laughs> just, like, I don't understand why everyone's calling him not normal. That's <laughs> uh, just kind of a joke. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and he knows that he no, isn't. I, yeah. I know that. <laughs> but so you're just saying it just wasn't a love connection, but there was a connection, but just maybe not a love connection. There's an age gap. Brendan, she said I, that. I think probably like the age gap, like, and I get age is just a number, but like that's kind of like a pretty big age gap. And, but overall, like anything else was fine. I can't really, have, I don't know. I can't have really you, tell have you. Have you gone on any dates since that? No. Mm. 
I mean, it was Friday. So. Yeah, it was Friday, Brendan. It was this past Friday? Yeah. yeah. What are we in? Oh, you're a pretty girl. I know girls go on dates every goddamn night. Yeah, have you she's seen girls girl? going wild, those videos? Dude, have I ever? <laughs> those girls they are got always my dating. Money, bro. Yeah. God, yeah. they're dating on boats. Yeah, <laughs> no, I had, a, I had a busy weekend with friends. There was no time for a date. That makes sense. I love your attitude. Carly, thank you so much for being uh, a part of uh, Chender and for just helping us look for love for our friend. Thank you, Carly. Oh, cool. You're great. No, honestly, thank you guys so much. That's creepy, was, It's actually been a lot of fun and an hilarious story to tell people. Yeah, you're and great. Now, and now I'm fans of you guys. So, and like I said, like my, a lot of my friends are fans of you guys. So now I'm going to look up, see when you guys are like in town, maybe you can see like a show or love something. It. Yeah, like we'll figure it out. But. Yeah. And we'll, uh, yeah, we'll share you on our social media on King and the Stink so that, you know, if there is a young man out there that, you know, could be your type. You might get some creepers, but whatever. <laughs> a oh lot gosh, of perks. No, seriously, so he tagged me, and like a bunch of people just like started following me and like DMing me. But then like a couple people were like, "Oh, like if Chin doesn't work out, you know, like I'll take you out." But I'm like, I can't see your profile because it's private. You have nothing in your bio. Yeah, don't. Your picture is like a cartoon. Or oh, that was sky. Nick. That was our producer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, hey, that 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 was Nick in my opener of song. So I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm just joking. Nick's a Nick's a legend, man. He's a good guy. Yeah. But no, so a lot of creepers already came no, after seriously, you. Seriously, huh? that was a song, and I apologize. <laughs> I was just like trying to wean through them. I was like, okay, okay. Just yeah. ignore him. Yeah, you're you're doing the damn thing. Thank you for being on this. You're a great uh, sport about it. It's not easy. Oh, of course. No, this has been probably top five things. You're the best. Enjoy. All right, Carly. Good luck out there in love. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. You take care. Have a good one. See ya. Okay, bye. Carly doing the damn thing, man. She's attractive. Dude, huh? both of you guys. I'm proud of both of you guys. You guys did a great job. Mm -hmm. You guys um, killed that. That could have been a nightmare. You guys killed that. Yeah. The so, you guys shot it well. Everything was here's great. Here's my thing. Obviously, Chin, that's not a match. What if we open it up to other people? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, he's 47. Yeah. Chin's 51. She's 21. Yeah. She's like, yeah, I guess. Um, but you could even we could help a bunch of people find some love, man. You know, bro. We can barely fucking keep our shit together, dude. Okay, are you sure? Well, well. we don't even have a key to the bathroom in the hall. Are you sure <laughs> we can help people? Legit point. Find love. Man. Legit point. Help dude. my boy Hassan, man. He needs it the most. No, dude. dude it's tough. Guy, that that guy. Hey, listen. That we we tough, gotta go. I hate bro. to be shitty. You know, Hassan's a tough set. We did chan. That's a tough set. Yeah. Hassan years looks like old. somebody that lives hey, in the shells of a library. Dude, it. okay. It's a tough set. Hassan, you know, being Indian, like we can only do so much. We're not fucking. <laughs> hey, Hassan looks no, no, like a dude. This that, is King of this thing, not make a wish. Hassan <laughs> <laughs> looks like a dude that sleeps in a really old book. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna fucking. Hassan no, looks like remember when you were a kid? He looks like that worm that crawls out of the apple you know what I'm saying? <laughs> with the glasses on oh that's mean <laughs> dude you said he slept that's in, he sleeps in a book bro. let's see what fucking gay let's see what non-gay let's see what non-gay dad says let's go to non-gay dad head again let's go to non-gay dad head and see what he says oh that does look like a son of that's a son but brown but he's a brown worm oh that they're brown dude he's a brown no, oh, there the, is. that's a son <laughs> that's a son that's a son Whatever we do next time, if we send Chin, strangers, what about Ari? Asan, Ar I love the idea. I love, I love the idea no. of Ari. <laughs> Ari's a liability, dude. <laughs> Signs a waiver. Bro, it better you be a, a huge girl on the waiver. dark web. It better be a huge waiver. Either way, next time we have to have a, a AirPod in someone's ear, and you guys are feeding and them. And we're lines. in a van. Yes. We could we could hear we could hear you. their conversation the whole time. But if we could go the other way, oh, that's can, what makes it. We can it help. Gold. We can help Chin or Ari out, and we'll be like, "Yo, dude, ask her." You know. Mm -hmm. Dude, pour another shot. <laughs> Spill it on your pants. Stop <laughs> staring at her titties. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Guys, I have an announcement to make to you guys, though. You're married. Not married, but Kat knows this. I told Nick already. Are you coming out right you now? You told what, Nick? I told Nick because we were filming. I'm like, used I can't, a racial slur. I Sorry, can't do. I'm not gonna do like you know something crazy. So I've been dating my best friend for a little while now. It's Kat. No. No, he's a he's a powerlifter from Fresno. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's a girl. You guys know you met her before. I met her. You met her. Multiple Who's times. gay? Somebody's gay or not? <laughs> No, that's what I. No, I, I, thought, I thought she was coming out right now. I was like, dude, I don't. I appreciate you're brave. You're brave. Yeah. Do it on King of the Sing. You're brave coming out, dude. 
Shin said he had sex with Aaron Hernandez in high school. <laughs> <laughs> you you're really dating someone, Jin? Yeah. Cat knows. Yeah. Have you met her, Cat? Where did did I meet her in uh, San One Diego? One of the shows. One of the shows. That's all I'm gonna say. I don't want to go too. I don't want to. Did you meet her? Did I meet her in San Diego or San Francisco? One of those. Ooh. So, Chin, hold on. San Francisco. We paid for two hours of food for you and this <laughs> hey, lady. Man, it's a great <laughs> show. Hold on, my friend Hawk Carlin have a chance. <laughs> it's a great show. She's playing a game she can't win. <laughs> she said the how? age gap is ridiculously crazy. There's no way. Well, how's the girl you're dating? Closer to my age. That sounds vague, man. It sounds like this girl doesn't uh, even exist. I feel like we got honey. Yeah, it's definitely I've had that girl from before, dude. In middle school, I told everybody I had a girlfriend that lived in the town <laughs> next door. Yeah, yeah. And I met you her You sound one like time. Aaron Hernandez high school quarterback right now. That yeah. never happened. Let's go to that quarterback's dad again. Let's bring up another picture of that dad. <laughs> Let's see if he believes it. <laughs> well, my son, I didn't. Everybody did it. Everybody was dating Aaron. Wow, everybody Chance, you're dating, huh? Well, fuck. My friend Carly didn't even have a chance. Yeah, you, uh, you told us that, Brendan. But what I'm saying is this, dude. Next time we're paying for two hours worth of food and liquor. <laughs> okay. Next time you order seven awesome. fucking sake bottles, I thought you were going to get your so dick you. sucked. The only reason I agreed to pay for what? it. What? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Who are you, Darren Sharper? <laughs> Chill out, bro. What Do else? seven bottles of sake? Somebody getting their dick sucked. That's, the That's science. Yeah, usually That's it's math. You... That's dating math. <laughs> they go over six right. bottles like, well, here we go. So if I can't do me on Tinder, someone else for sure. Somebody else. Well, you should have told us that before we no. had two hundred and seventy dollars. You should have told us that before we in invested a hundred grand to the goddamn graphics and music. <laughs> uh, but yeah, before we yeah. had. You know what? This is like the Bachelor and the guy before it starts going. Uh, sorry, I got married last week. <laughs> you fucked this. Dude. I didn't fuck anyone. Look, Literally, motherfucker. Look here, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny when he guesses. You're going on dates again. <laughs> All right? You're going on at least two more dates. <laughs> hey, bro. Odds are, hold on. You're dating your best friend that's a power lifter out of Fresno? Bro, that ain't working out. Yeah. Well, yeah. A, that's not working out. B, that's a dude named Greg. He'll understand, dude. Yeah, bro. The Fresno bear will understand. The, <laughs> the rare bear of Fresno, dude. That Fresno bulldog will understand if you're Chin seeing Baca. some other dudes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just see some hairy dude named Chin Baca rolling out of the woods right now. You're going to hell, Chin, probably. Oh. I shouldn't have said that, but if that's the way you treat people, you're taking somebody. Hey, she had a great time. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're right, man. Never mind. She had a good time. Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. She's playing a game she can't win. You know. Yeah. Cat, <laughs> what do you feel like? What are your takeaways? You were there. You were on the. You were um, there in the foxhole. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. It went a lot better than any of us thought it would go. The only issue is, I think we wanted Chin in his element, so we went to go get Korean barbecue. But it was so hard to film there. Mm -hmm. There were so many unfriendly Korean workers who <laughs> kept telling us to put our cameras. Hey, through. hey, standard. Though. Yeah, <laughs> cameras. Standard. But why hey, is they're, that? They're assholes. Why I mean, is I'm that? I'm sure a lot of people want to film in there. It's just distracting for people. But yeah. also. But why couldn't they They're be? Assholes. Uh, were they, <laughs> if they weren't helpful? Like, I mean, you're Korean. Are you yeah. Korean? Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> but, but were they were they Korean or were they Chinese? There might be some Chinese the workers Chinese, there, yeah. but they're the Chinese mostly Korean. take no shit, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You ever been around Chinese people? They take oh, yeah. no shit. They're so rude. Oh yeah. Very very dangerous, basically. <laughs> when I was trying to get permission to film at these places earlier in the day, I was telling them that uh, I had a I was working for a couple and it was their one year anniversary and this was their first first date spot and they didn't give a fuck. <laughs> Shut it down. Yeah. Fucking tramps. Mm. Trans, you mean? <laughs> <laughs> nope, tramps. <dude. laughs> I want to keep my jobs. But tramps. Aren't, a lot of them are last name Tran, aren't they? That's what I meant. That's I didn't right. mean trans. Oh, you right. I meant Tran. A lot of my people. Yes, yes. they are. Yeah. The Tran boy. Get on the train or get off, dude. <laughs> well, Chin. Well, let me ask you this, Cat. Where do we go from here? Yeah, that's a good I mean, question. now we know Chin's getting fucking married next week. <laughs> we got to find someone else. Someone else who wants to come on. We need let's, to find let's somebody. think about it. Mm -hmm. Nick has a lady. Yep, we're official now. It's Damn. going really well. All right. Again, you're, bra you're bragging a lot this episode, man. <laughs> Oh, he's got a lady, dude. You're killing it, dude. He's trying, looking up. He's trying to set up his senior up. buddy over he, there. He has, a, he has a dope ride. You got a lady. Uh, Derek's yeah. obviously busting nuts left and right. We know <laughs> this. Married this year, baby. 
Of course you are. It's because you knocked your girl up, you freak. <laughs> I got to do what I got to do, dog. <laughs> yeah, like, Shit, dude. <laughs> Bro, you knocked my girl off the way you're at it. <laughs> yeah, keep your eyes off my girl, man. <laughs> I had to keep the window so that, closed so that my girl wouldn't even get pregnant. <laughs> I don't even have a girl. I'll say God, this. I'm so I'll, fucking lonely. Bro. I'll, 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 <laughs> oh, man. I'll, yeah. I mean, I'll say it. We can what are you out. saying, I'll dude? say this. You're, I mean, How many more I'll, ideas are you going to come up with well, today, You're, you're hopeless. We don't want to, you're a liability. We don't yeah. do that. I'm a liability? You, 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 you sent a guy who's not even You can't take your date on the 12-step program. Okay. That's not a first date, dude. Bro, that She's third. like, what? I'm not even on step one. What yeah. is, why are we in eight right now? <laughs> that third step's a doozy, bro. Why is Dak Shepard always here? <laughs> <laughs> that third step's a doozy, boy. <laughs> That's hilarious. Cat single. Can yep. I say that, Cat? Yeah, go Kat, ahead. Cat, you're single? Yeah. I'm what so happened? Such trouble. Uh, just didn't work out. Wow. God, dude. You oh don't have to get too God, personal dude. with her. <laughs> that would be trouble, though. The fucking oh slime that would yeah. come out and try and date Cat. <laughs> that would be crazy. We'll have to help I think out. We, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but, but I think we're in the truck. And, huh? and But we're in the ramp. We don't we're, have a truck. Okay. <laughs> we'll get a truck. we get a van. We'll call it King's Thing Van. We'll get it white. Put honey all the over the ski shuttle. No, this <laughs> is so, see, dude. The ski shuttle. This doesn't end well. It's like yeah, a magic bus, but yeah, yeah, ski. yeah. But but we'll put we'll be in the get the random dudes air to, oh. to make it work with cat. Oh, so there's a chance it with cat. Yeah. I, I, I don't feel comfortable. I feel like we're setting Cat up to get murdered. I feel like we're setting I, ourselves up to definitely get in a cat thoughts issue. concerns. Let's see. I am open to the idea if I see Chinder work with a couple more people. Okay. Yeah, we don't we don't hit up Cat right that. now. It's too early. It's too, too early. early. Well, we'll see what happens. Maybe we'll f we'll have somebody come in and see if we can find them someone. Maybe we'll put Ari out on the dark web. Ari's very he has, he's great. <laughs> 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 That's what people do when they shoot on their friends. No, no, he's cool. No, don't get me wrong. He's fantastic. My boy. He's my boy. He's my boy. Dude, I love him like a brother. I don't trust him. Yeah. <laughs> I just don't want him showing up the next day and be like, hey, I got this new jacket. And he'd be like, yeah, her name's Belinda. Okay? <laughs> like, are you like a guy who will make a fucking... Where we can't show the date? Yes. Like, dude, did you guys shoot three people on your date? <laughs> <laughs> dude, why did your date just cut to the first season of Dexter? <laughs> dude, why did you guys buy first round trip take us to Hawaii? Yeah, and only one of you guys came back <laughs> and, and charged our card, though. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, look, we can see what happens, man. We could, yeah. Look, anybody could find love, so it's possible. You know, we'll see what happens. Something good could happen, bro. Not cat, not yet. Cat, not yet. Just, not spit yet. Just brainstorming ideas here. Hello. Hello. Dude, why are you still living in the past? Man, you have to ask who it is at your door when you can already know, bro. Oh, you're so right, dude. You could have been a robber. Yeah, I could have been, you man. You could have been a robber trying to steal all my stuff. I could have been a burglary, bro. You got to know what's up, dude. Simply safe home security. It's like getting commercial grade enterprise level security, but for your own home, B. Here's the thing, dude. Outdoor cameras and doorbells alert you to anyone walking around your house. Mm -hmm. You don't want to wait. Oh, did someone break in? Oh, I'm gonna call the cops now. Too late. Yep. Too late. Everything you don't have you yourself to blame. Yeah. Everything you love is gone. Yeah. yeah Every haven't you ever watched First Forty Eight? Yeah. It always dude. goes down. Haven't you ever watched the last Forty Eight, dude? It's at a funeral because you didn't take care of yourself. Because you didn't have Simply Safe. Simply Safe protects your home from fires, water damage, and carbon monoxide poisoning. Yeah. How about entry motion glass break sensors? What? Glass yeah. break sensors? Good luck getting in. It's all monitored 24-7 by live security professionals. You can set up your system yourself. No tools needed. And Simply Safe experts can do it for you if you want. If you can't figure out, ready for this? It's only 50 cents a day. No contracts. What's your safety worth to you? Yeah. 50 cents a day? 50 cents. 50 cents. That's a dollar every two days. That's three dollars and 50 cents a week. Bro. Go to Simply Safe, S I M P L I S A F E dot com slash K A T S to save on home security today. That's S I M P L I Safe dot com slash cats. Get the cats, get the cats, get the cats. Bro, that hair in the back getting a little long, brother. It's getting a little long. 
You don't have to worry about losing it. But here's the thing. 66% of men start to lose their hair by the age of 35. But that's why I grew mine out. I noticed maybe a little bit of thin. I went, I can't have this. I can't have I'm start growing it out. I'm start using just, just. I'm going to start using hims. And then what, it's. I got the stick mane, bro. Oh, you look beautiful, man. Thanks, You've really bro. come a long way. When I met you, wasn't as good looking. And now you better looking than you were. Because my hair, bro, I look like Razor Ramon. Thanks to 4 One-stop shop for hair loss, skin care, sexual wellness for the bros. Oh, yeah. Look, sexual wellness. If anybody knows about being sexually unwell, it's... Yeah, boy. <laughs> okay. You know what I'm saying, bro? I'll bring an, er- an erection to a fucking crafts and uh, arts and crafts environment, dude. Yeah, it's just not proper, is yeah, it, man? Yeah, right. Yeah, there's nothing better, all right? No snake oil pills or gas station counter stuff. I'm talking about real stuff. Prescription solutions backed by science. Yeah, you don't buy that stuff over the gas station. You you know, you're getting a couple quarts of diesel and one of them rhino hitters at the at the gas station, Yeah, you don't dude. want that. Yeah, one of those. You got to have that erection. It glitter all over yeah, it. Yeah, dude, get <laughs> out of here, get bro. Out of here, bro. <laughs> I'm trying to get pumping, dude. Yeah, don't get right. Listen, no more awkward in-person doctor visits or long pharmacy lines. Forget all that. Get your body right. Get your dick right, Son, quit yeah. quit living like a fucking little inchworm, bro, and yeah. show up with that snake to your stepmother's freaking funeral, bro. Yes, yeah, 2020, hit that rooter out. Be Dang. somebody, dude. Show up with a real root, bro. Yeah. Three month minimum subscription. Prescription requires an online consultation with a physician who will determine if the prescription is appropriate. That's easy. Do you get your first month free? Of course. All you, you gotta do. do is go to forhims.com slash K A T S. That's forhims.com slash K-A-T-S. All day, every day, cats. Whoops. For him.com slash cats. Uh, can you read the blue part, too? Offer valid if prescribed three-month minimum subscriptions. Additional restrictions apply. See website for full details, important safety information. Hillary was talking shit to Bernie this morning. Did you guys see that? So funny. Old people talking shit. She said nobody likes she said Bernie. Nobody likes him. <laughs> then did you see the other old broad talk shit to Bernie, too? I just think it's great that old people are finally fighting with each other in public, dude. Oh, nothing better when old people throw fists. Oh, bro. Oh, bro, yeah. Because nobody gets hurt. Yeah, it's like yeah, watching yeah. women's fighting. It's great. <laughs> yeah, no. It's like, yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. Well. You guys want to do a topic? <laughs> <laughs> sure, man. I'm, I'm just trying to take all, the, all, the, all, all that in. Chin yeah. as a girl. Go ahead. I yeah. like, man, cat. <laughs> I feel like her blood's on my hands now. A lot has happened. A lot has happened. I, Chin, I'm, I'm not trying to be funny. I'm, I well, I know that. Chin, I, I can vouch for that, Chin. You can vouch for that. <laughs> okay, yeah. I literally, I thought Chin was going to come out right now. He's like, yeah, I have it. a big announcement. I was like, oh, I, know. I fucking knew it. I don't because Asian people are usually pretty smart. If it took you 42 years and you were gay, this would be the worst fucking math I've ever <laughs> ever seen in my life. Bro. The worst, this would be the, probably the worst platform to do. Asian people, people know they're gay when they're four or five, dude. They fucking, I don't know, dude. You don't think no, so? No. They, no, they lose the dream of being samurais. I'm like, oh, fuck, I'm gay. Yeah. And it, you, at some point, you have to kill yourself or something. What do you guys have to do? Jim? Yeah. <laughs> if you don't date? Yeah. Or if you want to see if you're gay or not? I don't know something. Did you have to something. cut off your pinky if you think you're gay? No. No, you have to kill know. yourself at your dad's yard or something. <laughs> you just can't tell you, you can't tell your parents. Isn't there a suicide forest? Yes. Japan. Yeah. Jesus Christ, mm. man. Crazy, right? Well, what do you got? What else you got? <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to do the name game real quick? Sure. One of the new topics? Yeah, let's get into one of the new topics, man. Oh, we topics? do have to announce we have some new topics. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So let's announce those right uh, now. New year, new right topics. Now? Yeah. What'd you say? Because uh, we have a special video for one of the new topics. Okay. And I was going to save it for after. Or we can do it now. It's up to you, buddy. Dog. Um, well, we're going to get it in the name game. Let's do it now. Do it now? Let's do it now. The new topic, boys, is Sink My Ink. Okay. We want people to send in pictures of your tattoos. Videos. videos. Of your tattoos. Yeah, videos, videos. Videos of why you know you got that tattoo and when and how fucked up you were and all yeah, that Yeah, brief stuff. videos. Brief videos. Brief. You know, it says Please. a documentary on your fucking tattoo on your ankle. Yes. Yeah. But we got our first submission, boys, and really? you might recognize this. I'm film. nervous about this. I have anxiety today. You do? Oh! Check out the tits on this one. Hey, guys, just got out of the shower. Don't have much time. Obviously, I'm a very busy man, but I heard about your new <laughs> bullshit segment or whatever it's called. Uh, <laughs> describe your tattoo or whatever kind of catchy thing you call it. But um, anyway, I uh, figured I'd be the first entry. Uh, yeah, I have tattoos, and I got them right here. It's the, and I got these by Dr. Wu. 
uh, who's a great artist, uh, and he did this. Look at the detail on that eagle. That's because I got that, that tired eagle joke that I have in the, my special on Netflix, Man on Fire, and that's for the Man on Fire, and that's what I got. Uh, and I got them when I was 37 because I wanted to get them because uh, I wanted to, I, want, I got them at that age because I never wanted to get them when I was younger because I thought I would regret them. Much like you guys definitely regret doing this podcast together. You absolutely do. I know you do. You guys don't regret that you have, have to do this podcast now because of the money. You're not doing it because you want to. You're doing it because of the money, and that's fine. But it's a cash grab at this point. Unlike my podcast, congratulations. This is straight from the soul. And I, don't do I do it because it's straight from the soul. Raping and raping for an hour. So, so guys, stop listening to the king in this thing. <laughs> Come on over to the congratulations. Podcast. Okay, you know how you can you know how you can come on over. You can use this fucking plane. <laughs> you can use that plane. Just hop in and get the fuck away from this. The king and the sting, or the sting and the king. I don't even know what the fuck it's called, to be honest. <laughs> oh my god! Thanks, Billy. Oh, oh my god! Oh, that's so good. First of all, how did this goon, okay, infiltrate <laughs> our airwaves? <laughs> <laughs> Young Nicholas. <laughs> Young Nicholas. Had it oh up. man! Yeah, hey, this is your buddy, dude. dude this this is your buddy, <laughs> Brendan. You chime in, dude. Oh man, I don't know where to begin. <laughs> It's cash grab. <laughs> you guys have to do it. Oh, first, also, I want to let you guys know that uh, this video submission was brought to you by the Cash App. <laughs> Your whole podcast is because you need the money, dude. Yeah, dude. <laughs> well, look, Brandon, this is you and uh, this is you and Brian's fucking meal ticket. So why don't you guys fucking why don't you guys answer this one, bro? <laughs> The only two people sitting on that plane on his arm are you and fucking Brian. <laughs> so why don't you answer this one? First of all, Delia said he hated tattoos, didn't he? Oh, Remember yeah. that? They used oh, to yeah. make fun of people with tattoos. And then he gets a tattoo, then he gets bro. A, gets a little money in the bank about a chain like a fucking like Gucci, man. He got tatted up. Not only did he get tatted up, but he did it on his fucking arm, literally on his wrist where everybody can see it. And somebody said it was hiding. He had like some type of a skin disorder or something that it was hiding. Which is something that I heard, but I also could have made that up. It wouldn't kill him to use a little just for men on that beard either. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, maybe something to brush in. Yeah, I wouldn't yeah, go anything a heavy. Something. Nothing too heavy. Yeah, I wouldn't go real dark, you know? Um, that was so fucking funny. Sink my ink, dude. How do you do it? What sink flight ink. is that on his arm? Because we could easily sink it if it was flight TWA 564, whatever one that one is. What I'll about you guys over in Vietnam? You guys are taking down planes like nothing, <laughs> left and right. Yeah, you guys Malaysia, are hiding them. Huh? Yeah, you guys are hiding them, huh? Yeah, dude. No. You're flying over Iraq. That's an easy one to take down than blame it on somebody else. Am I right? Yeah, look at this, dude. Sink my ink, bro. This is it, dude. Dude, it's a, yeah. sink it. Sink his ink. Sink it, Brendan. Sink, sink his ink. I'll give him this. I'll give this. That Doctor Wu is an amazing fucking. If you know oh, tattoos, God. that Doctor Wu is good. Who the that fuck Dr. Knows Wu is Doctor Wu is any good, bro? Who ain't good, dude? It's drawing. Okay, <laughs> All of it looks like third semester fucking art, bro. It's hey. fucking drawing, hey, dude. I, hey, how did you get out of New Orleans without any tattoos, man? <laughs> With the I shit have, you've been through? I have one tattoo, dude, and I'll never show it to you guys. Do you really? Oh, yeah. It's on your ass, isn't it? No, you creep. Where's it at? <laughs> huh? I'm not telling you. I just told you I wasn't telling you. Well, you don't have you to think I'm going to forget that in just a second? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not, dude. Dad, I can't, I can't believe you have a tattoo. Yeah, mother effer. I can't. Well, it's offensive, though, to some people. That's why I can't show it. Is it a Confederate flag? No. Dude, if I'm going offensive, I'm going offensive. Yeah, you go dude. full in. I'll yeah. give you that. Long as you fucking are, baby. Confederate flag is a little bit of laundry, bro. That's a little <laughs> bit of pole laundry, dog. I'm going offensive, dude. Uh, look, here's the thing about this tattoo, man. I've seen it 2,000 times, bro. This Talk tattoo, an, an the ego? flaming arm, bro. Nolan Ryan had that. <laughs> the old fucking hot arm, bro. That's nothing. Also, an eagle on fire. You see a lot of that down south at NASCAR events. You see, and usually it's on people's back. A lot of hell's <laughs> angels. Yeah, this seems like something some little like thought gets over there in Daytona. 
Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Daytona 500 standard tattoo. Yeah, this is a but wedding Because he got it by Dr. Wu. He thinks it's all flashy, dude. <laughs> Sometimes you got to leave LA and realize your tattoos ain't shit. Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, drive to Riverside and get your ass beat breaking out that fucking yeah. squid mistake. Yeah, show up in Ontario without your Harley with that tattoo. See what the fuck happens, bro. Yeah, dude. You can't show up on a fucking bird scooter. With that fucking limp piece of Van Gogh on your wrist, bro. You better have a Harley or some assless chaps. You go down to fucking Ontario with that bird tattoo, Yeah, get this guy out of my podcast, dude. Get this guy (laughs) out of my podcast, dude. God, that was fucking funny, though. Yeah. That's it, boys. So the new segments... uh, No, we need to tell all the new segments. Sink my ink. Sink my ink. And we have another one, too, don't we? Yeah, we forgot a little pre-production that we were going to side with. Oh, uh, uh, Chase My... Raise my case. Oh yeah. So raise this is, my case. So some other segments that we're going to do. One is called race my case, and that is where uh, the producers are going to put together uh, crimes that have happened, and we have to. The four of us have to guess what race could have done it. Mm-hmm. Fuck yeah. <laughs> so race my case will be good. <laughs> so that'll be a new segment, also known as True Detective season four. Yeah. What's up, bro? <laughs> oh, shit. Look at you, and me. True Detectives, bro. True Detective, dude. HBO show. Fuck, oh yeah, yeah. Dude. sorry man. Sorry, we're in. Yeah, True Detectives, man. <laughs> you're McConaughey. Though. Yeah, yeah, you're McConaughey, dude. You Woody Harrelson. Yeah, I'm Woody Harrelson. We're not the boy. shitty season though with Vince Vaughn. No, That's no, not us. First, first season. I'm Woody Harrelson, boy. <laughs> uh, what was the other one? I love that. I'm doing crime. We got now or then. Uh, you guys take a topic and argue whether it was better back then or now. Cars, music. Sent in by at Big Dog on IG. Yeah, we passed on that one, but okay, but that's okay. I say, I, I right, we didn't we didn't discuss this fully. I say next week we unveil one segment and we'll we'll do a new one every week. But this just we, keep adding one, yeah, yeah. We, and see which one sticks around. So yeah. race my good. case is fine. So next week, that's yeah, great. next week we'll do race my case and we'll do uh, the race name game. Race my case is hilarious. Yeah. yeah. So, well. That's it for today, boys. That's, you did a full. That's the episode. Oh, you guys ran through that one. We don't have ki- oh. debate club or king. We don't have sting. We can go a little long. I mean, we, we already. I'm saying you did the. It, how how long are we? We're, we're, how long we're, well, are we we're over an hour. Oh, really? That's yeah. Uh, we're we're like hour five. I'd love to get to this European name game. We can do the name one name game. Carl, Carl, let's do it. Carly wouldn't shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking? I'm just kidding. Shout out to Carly. <laughs> What's up, girl? You're so friendly. I'm just being silly. Make- yeah, that's true, dude. That bitch wouldn't quiet down, bro. <laughs> I'm joking, man. You got to take that part out. This whole episode was Hot Carl and Chris D'Elia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Well, it's your buddy, man. It's your buddy taking over our podcast with his shitty art. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dr. Boy. Wu, dude. Is that even a real Asian? I've never seen him or heard about him. Yeah, exactly, dude. dude. Who would let a fake Asian draw on him? He's big. Huh? Dr. Wu's big. <laughs> Dr. Dr. Wu's, Wu's not big. big. You don't know, I'm telling you, Dr. Wu's as big as they get. He's no. from Shamrock Social Club. I'm telling you. Dude, first of all, you barely got out of the back end of that fucking sentence. <laughs> Shamrock Social Club? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I saw you stair-stepping through it that time, too. Dude. I was hopscotching through the last one. Yeah. <laughs> Sam you had a good idea. Social Club. Sam Sam Rock Rock Social Club. Club. Sam Rock Social Club. What happened okay, to our it. white rapper friends? We got uh, the cats ra- cats battle rap coming back next week. We, Fuck yeah. Uh, we're we're going to be posting those videos, like we said last time, on IG this week. We're going to get a vote, and we're going to have a winner, and we got two two more fire submissions. Hell yep. yeah. Like, so look, like eight so, mile up in this bitch. Yeah, dude, like four <laughs> mile. So from time to time, dude. Yeah. So from time to time, we'll be rolling with some new segments. Uh, let's do name game, though, so people know yep. how to submit for name game. And you don't, you guys don't have to submit for race my case, I don't think. Could they submit cases? They could. They, they can could. try, but if we don't find good ones, we'll make it up and say it came from them. Okay. Yeah. All right, Dang, boys. bro. That's Thank you guys for having me, too, bro. A lot of ki- too. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. This is Nick from L.A. This is another Nick. Hey, guys. This is uh, Nick coming at you from the La Brea Tower podcast studio Dang. in Hollywood, California. Um, I got a little name game submission for you. And in honor of the Rat King returning from Europe... I was wondering if you guys could name European landmarks. Uh, thanks for all the laughs. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz. I mean, you were just there, so. Yeah, I can name a few. Home team. <laughs> I can name a few. Okay. It's an away game for your boy, huh? Okay. Um, <laughs> yeah, you've you been want there. You to start? Yeah, start. Big Ben. Roethlisberger? 
You're out, bro. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to go with Stonehenge, bro. Everybody's favorite figurine area, bro. A little bit of Stonehenge. What's that on your shirt? Oh, Stonehenge. A little stone, stony hengey. A little stony hengey. A little stony hinge cliff, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Red man. <laughs> Some guy gets up on their show on Kill Tony and sneezes and like, all right, that's your time, brother. You fucking, you did <laughs> shitty. Yeah. He's like, <coughs> I'm like yeah. that's your time. Get yeah, the yeah. fucking hit the drum. The man. guy's like, but I, I flew here. Uh, <laughs> I took four days off of work. Well, you're fired. So you're also fired. So I've come here every Monday, man, for the past fucking three months. Yeah. Dude. My wife hasn't seen me in, in a month. I've been camping outside. Yeah. Well, shitty first well, joke. Can we do <laughs> Your turn, Brendan, trying to evade it, huh? Uh, European landmarks, go, daddy. <laughs> European landmarks, go, daddy. Um, Eiffel Tower. Okay. Um, Arc de Triomphe. Wow. Yeah. Mm, that's a good one. Look oh, at shit. me impressing people with that one, dude. <laughs> you got me, bro. Brendan on wow, the rocks dude. right now. Well, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> This is, this is rope-a-dope. Brendan, just Rope-a-dope. Now, look, cut into Brendan's head. Where's Niagara Falls? Okay. <laughs> Brendan about to. Dude, you were just there, and you are you are crawling through these, bro. Brendan you are crawling lose. through these, dude. Brendan about to lose. Let's go, Brendan. Um, <laughs> oh, let me think here for a second. Yeah, go ahead. What's the giant fucking bridge in England? In London, 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 London. Can I say the London Bridge? <laughs> the London Bridge. <laughs> hey, hey, Alex, London Bridge for 3,000. Count it. Boom. That's good? Count it. Yeah. yeah. Count it. Oh, my God. That's a song. Uh-oh. Hey. Oh, oh. <laughs> hey, I was just there. Oh, oh. I didn't see anything. Oh, just green rooms. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's a song, you idiot. London Bridge? We're using songs now? Um... Let me think of Landmarks. something good. I got something good, bro. I'm not even worried, dude, because I got the Trevi Fountain play. Boy. Isn't that a club in Miami? Fountain Blue? <laughs> <laughs> Trevi Fountain in Rome. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Well done. That's that LM, baby, yeah, that that's, landmark. That really surprised Derek. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I'm like, what? <laughs> I got one for you. How about the Coliseum, son? <laughs> Coliseum of what? In Italy, bro. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn, dog. Just checking you, dog. Get out my grill, bro. Just <laughs> checking you, dude. You got to know what's up, Dude, I haven't thought about it forever. <laughs> I know what I'm going to say, man. I'm not some freaking nutcase like you are, dude. What I would go with is the Hamburg Zoo. Is that a landmark? <laughs> yes, it is, dude. Probably the greatest zoo ever. <laughs> it's a place. I don't know. Wow, it's a it's a pl- it is a place in Germany. Yeah, but is that a landmark? Ooh, I don't know, man. Is that a land? I don't know if that's a. It is a. It's an the establishment. Hamburg there's a McDonald's over there too. Zoo. Yeah, there's a fucking. <laughs> yeah, there's a zoo in any city. I could say the fucking Rome Zoo. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Rome Zoo is not on there. Ooh, it's also it's called the well, you, it's called the Tier Park Hagenbeck. He zoo. didn't say that. He didn't say that. The Hagen bag. He said up. zoo in Europe. <laughs> <laughs> European zoo for three thousand, Alex. The and Hamburg zoo. Dude, you're dude. out. You're what? out, bro. Do you know what kind of animals they have there? Bring up pictures of animals at the Hamburg Zoo, dude. It's just French guys. No, it isn't. It's just Jewish people. <laughs> Yeah, it's here, Bark Hagenbeck. That Hagenbeck, yeah. Dog. He didn't say he didn't say that tear park Hagenbeck. Look at that elephant, bro. Look at Ooh. that tortoise. That looks like every fucking zoo I've ever seen, dude. <laughs> oh, whatever. <laughs> whatever, man. He's a jerk, You're bro. out, bro. The Hamburg out. Zoo, man. You're out, bro. I'm sorry. Oh, that's bullshit. You got, you got the how about the 16th chapel, bro? The, the Vatican? 16th? The Vatican? What is what's up with the Vatican, bro? Huh? What about the 15th chapel, dog? Okay. All right. Now you're talking. Now you're talking, bro. Now you're talking about. What about How about the Notre Dame? That bitch caught on fire. <laughs> Let this motherfucker burn. Burn, mother. Of course that thing went up in fire. 
Dude, you guys. Dude, even though you just got back from Europe and you lost in the name game, not a big deal. I'm still rooting for you, dude. I'm Thanks, glad you bro. came in today, bro. I'm rooting for you too, man. I'm happy to be here today, man. Thank you guys so much for having me, dude. Dude, you keep saying that, man. Your names right there. You're yeah, like, thanks hey, for having uh, me, dude. dude. We're thanks kinda for... in your studio now, dude. <laughs> thanks for having I mean, me. Thanks for allowing me to be part of the show, I guess. Thanks dude. for having me, yeah. Kat. Thank you for oh, having us, welcome. Kat. It's the year of the rat, so I had to let you hear. Ooh. Is it the year of the rat? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it is, it's boy. It's the year of the rat. So all of you fucktards know what's about to happen, dude. Dude, this thing is sick. All oh. of you guys, man. Daddy might have to get a tattoo Don't from even Dr. Wu. <laughs> it's the comeback of the rat, son. Like I was never gone, bro. Never gone, bro. Yeah, get on your knees and serve the cheese, baby, because I'm coming for it, son. <laughs> oh, you wow. feel me? You tell Dirt Lee I'm fucking coming to get my belt back, too. You guys gave it to that fucking pansy over there. Well, we let the fans vote, you know? At that old show. <laughs> sure you did, dude. I mean... Who are the fans? It's just you and Brian Callen. <laughs> we know Brian doesn't even know we give out guest of the year. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, Brian, huh? doesn't, Brian doesn't know anything. No. <laughs> Brian looks like Elf on the Shelf, dude. <laughs> when he's not working during the holidays, you know? I'm like, damn, bro. <laughs> You need a blood. Brian looks like Elf on the Shelf and Honey, I Shrunk the Kids yeah. before he got shrunk. He looks like blood transfusion on the shelf. Doesn't he look like Elf on the Shelf if he you know about, You're talking about rinks on the shelf? Yeah. Rinks on the shelf. Dude, that, that would sell like hotcakes. Rink on the shelf. Oh, man. Just have some old dude doll on the shelf. You don't yeah. need holidays for that. Mm-mm. We'll send one to Carly. What about Perv on the curb? That'd be another one, dude. It's just that perverted looking dude. Yeah. You set him on a curb somewhere. Yeah, big fat guy with his tongue like this. Mm. Dude, I'll let you know also, uh, on t- on this past weekend, we're coming out with uh, Crystalia voodoo dolls, actually, that we're going to be selling. <laughs> P- poke fucking pins in them. Oops. 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 It's going to be sick, bro. You put dents in it. Yeah, dude. You, oh, yeah. you can just put as many no, no, no. dents as you, you want. You should create a big doll you can just beat the fuck up and put a bunch of dents in it. That'd be sick. Yeah, that's what he just said, Brendan. <laughs> It's exactly what he just said. Yeah. No, he said little doll. I'm talking I'm, I'm a oh, full size. Life size. I'm talking like one of the ones chin fucks. One of those big fucking. Oh, one of those six oneers. Yeah. That's Chin's the only one that gets the real long sex doll. <laughs> you sure you want this? Comes in three parts. You sure? You sure? I know it's on discount, but you sure you want the Jay Leno chin yeah. on this one? Yeah. <laughs> Well, Chin had a chance at love, and he let it pass. Chin, do you have any closing remarks? No. Um, I hope she has a great future. Find someone great. Well, that's weird. I don't know. <laughs> she's a, she's a, yeah, she's hopefully, a great. her future is not right? dark. Yeah. Yep. We got to help somebody find love, man. Yeah. We got, let's let's think about it. All of us get together. We're going to think of a new. I think we still call it Chinder, no matter what. Oh yeah. I think the segment's called Chinder, mm-hmm. but me and Theo are in a van. <laughs> <laughs> Like fucking Scooby Dooby. <laughs> and I would have. Hey, met- you're the dog. Yeah. <laughs> Scooby. Scoob. Joy Scoob. And I would have met somebody if it wasn't for you bastards. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, uh. dude. So it needs to make a graphic of all this in that fucking skeet van like Scooby Doo. Amen, <laughs> bro. I got to donate blood at 1.30 here, actually. I gotta, really? Some Someone's going to take some your blood? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Wow. What poor souls. Like, <laughs> yeah, they come here and get it. What? They come here and take it? Lady named Myrna. What kind of yeah. dark web donation is this, yeah, dude? dude? <laughs> bro, it's supposed to be on the up and up. Well, that's cool, They have a cool, website. Man. Uh, all right, man. Well, that's it. I'm in Charlotte this. When are we dropping this this week? Yeah, yep. Thursday night. Thursday. Uh, I'm in Charlotte Thursday, Friday, Saturday next week, Columbus, Ohio, baby. Yep, and I'll be in Denver this weekend. We're out in Denver, dog. South Comedy. You're at the Landmark South. Yeah. Why South? Just going to work on some new material. Just going there. You don't want nice. to do the uh, downtown one? Mm-mm. There's I, more seats at the. My one. papa lives across the street. From, really? Literally across the street from the downtown one? Uh, no, from, from the South. south. Dude, bring him over. It'd be cool. Yeah, be nice to him. Yeah, yeah. I will. Hey, hey, please don't clown my dad. I would never do that, yeah. man. He'd oh, sock you right in the fucking yeah. nose. Would he really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it'd be cool. Yeah, it'd be fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, show like with that. black eyes. Yeah, yeah. My dad's like, sorry, man. Yeah. <laughs> don't bring up black stuff around his dad. His dad gets hood as fuck, bro. Really? God. Yeah, oh, yeah. He was yeah, asking yeah, about really. chitlins. I'll go jersey <laughs> shopping with your dad, dude. That's what I'm talking about. Fuck yeah, dude. Um, I'm assuming those are sold out, but... Yeah, we got to... Uh, I'm glad we're back, man. Yeah, dude, it's good to be back, man. We got an exciting year, a lot of new um, new segments, new segments, new merchandise. 
Ooh, uh, our, the merch coming. We got some spicy fine. for that ass merch. We got some new <laughs> common, uh, artwork. Bro. Everything's good. We're cruising along, some man. Hot dogs. Yep. Chin <laughs> found love, even though he didn't tell us he already had it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Worst episode of The Bachelor ever. <laughs> God. Where you find out he's married right before. They're, <laughs> imagine if he did on ABC. They're like, this, this, all these people are here for you, man. Yeah. <laughs> we have helicopters. You're supposed to go to Paris. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry, man. I got found someone right before I got here. <laughs> That's what you did to us, Jin. <laughs> Hope you're happy, bro. Congratulations. Thanks for playing. Yeah. Shout out to Carly. Hot Carl. Yeah, Carly, we love you. We do um, love you, especially me, girl. You got the, what were we going to say? Gang, gang. Buzz, buzz. <laughs> <laughs>